Hi. Hi. Today we'll be talking about Pakistan's government role in response to flooding and climate change. Coco, what has the Pakistan government been doing to address the floods and climate change? So, um, in terms of the twenty twenty two floods, it's mainly cash assistance and provincial governments redirected development funds to flood relief. Islamabad also has verified fundraising agencies and a GoFundMe website. Um, it seems that it has not been doing a good job with city planning. There were um illegal structures and structures by the river that were severely impacted uh, by the two thousand and ten flood. However, um, these structures still existed in the twenty twenty two flood. Exactly. And technology to predict weather patterns and communication to vulnerable communities were not enforced. Data collection and mapping were not done to achieve that either. And there wasn't a flood management or disaster management system in Pakistan. Irrigation department was corrupted, so therefore the lands of the powerful people are saved first from the flooding. Yeah, the country is in an economic crisis, so there are few resources to divert to disaster management. The government also had a slow response, according to an article. The devastation had continued for many days, and the floods began in mid June. But the formation of a new national flood response and coordination center was announced as late as the twenty ninth of August. The Pakistan government took more than two months to res respond to the flooding, and NGOs are also restricted in the country.